Hey, welcome to the short guide about our Remix feature. The Remix feature allows you to do edits to your 3D model, like changing specific styles, adding or removing stuff, and basically doing anything you can imagine. And in this short video, I'll show you how. I prepared three examples, this character, we have this character from our dashboard, and we have this dog I generated from text 3 d We'll start with this character and we can simply click Remix model. This loads a capture view. Uh, where we have to position the model to so the camera looks from uh, on it from the front, basically. Um, we can set the front and then we can simply click set front and continue. Now that it created the base for the edits, we can simply put in the changes we want. We can disable and enable views we want to add to the changes. For example, we might want to make changes to the back, we might want to add the side view as reference, but in my case, or usually, just the first front view is, is perfectly fine. So let's start by giving him a sword instead and putting him on a pedestal. So we can say change the X to be a sword and put him on a wooden pedestal. And before we generate um, the new 3D model or the new edits, we can simply click improve prompt, which is good for getting better results and usually takes about 20 to 30 seconds, but really helps with increasing the detail and the results uh, of the edits. So um, we'll wait until it's done and I'll see you there. Now that the prompt has been improved, we can simply choose a model we like. I usually go for Gemini edit and then we can simply click generate variations. And after a few seconds, the variations have been generated and we can simply choose one which we like. In my case, let's go with this one. And now that we make the changes, we can simply click Generate 3D Model, and this will generate a 3D model based on the changes we made. Now let's head over to the stock we generated. We can go through the same process again, click Remix Model. And here this defines the first view where you make edits on. So you can either capture it from the front, in this case I'll capture it from a bit from the side. Click Set Front and Continue. This will capture the six different views. And we can then put in a prompt, um, and let's just give him armor. Let's say, add armor to the body of the dog. Then we click improve prompt, so we get better results. And then we click generate. And these look great. You can now choose a model which you like. In my case, let's go with this one. And now we can directly generate a 3D model, or we can edit the image further. For example, we can add horns, we can change the color, the style, and much more. Let's go over how we can do it in the dashboard. You can simply open any model you have. Let's open this one, and click Remix Model. Let's push it, position it to be from the front, maybe a bit above, so the generation is a bit cleaner. So we'll click Capture. This will capture all views again, and we can then input our edits in the prompt box. In my case, let's say, put a sword in his hands and make him be in an action pose. You could, of course, also change the clothes, you can change the background, you can change basically anything you can imagine. In this case, let's also click improve prompt. And now that the improved prompt has been generated, we can simply click generate variations again. And that doesn't look bad, you can now of course choose one of these models or adjust your prompt to make other changes. For example, you can change the clothes as well, you can change the weapon, the pose and much more. And once you're ready, you can simply click Generate 3D Model and also load it into the Image to 3D tool where you can generate your 3D model. And as you can see here, the model which we just edited in the Remix feature tool got generated and we can now use that, download it and or remix it again. And, and all your changes, images and 3D models are stored in your dashboard. I hope this short guide was helpful and um, try it out if you haven't, it's, it's super super fun and uh, I'll see you soon.